Good morning, I'm Mary Ellen and I have now been on YouTube for nine years. Today I wanna to talk about my experience doing YouTube videos for that long. I want to review a few skincare items I purchased. I wanna announce the winners of my last giveaway. And throughout this video, I'm gonna put, you know, a few second screenshot, hopefully side by side, of the last eight years that I have you know, been filming. One thing I noticed in all of them, I am never perfect. I am, I have always have something wrong and it's okay. It, I, I am like in real life, I'm a perfectionist, but since I started doing YouTube, I really have given myself a break. I have, there, there are things that I have put up that I thought, you know what? That was the best I could do that day. Another day, I may do better, but I have given myself a break. I know in 2014, 2015, and 2016, and these are gonna be put up in order. I don't know if I'll be able to put the dates with it, but you'll know that the first one is 2014. I was coloring my own hair, and I hated coloring my hair. I had done it for probably since I was 45, and in 20, 17, I have on pink pajamas and I don't have on any makeup and my hair was cut short. That was the first time that I had my hair done at the salon and I have not done it myself since and she does a much better job than I ever did. I go four times a year. I go every three months and she does my roots and then once a year she she does highlights. But uh, I, I'm really happy with the color of my hair. From 2017 on, I'm happy with the color of my hair. That happened to be, of the videos I picked out, that one was the only one that I didn't have makeup. And there was something I noticed. My eyebrows, I have gotten them so much thicker since I started using Grande Brow and also derma rolling my brows. I noticed that and then this scar it's probably it's 65 years old because I got it when I was four years old. I don't have any makeup on today besides mascara and lipstick and navy eyeliner, that's all. And it's just so much lighter than it was. My most popular videos on YouTube are skincare and they're my very least favorite to film. It all depends on like today it's sunny out, I have to have my door shut. So my light is never consistent. So it's really hard to do comparison photos, but I know, and I think you'll be able to tell through some of these, some of these videos, I look younger, some of them I look older, but I really feel like the skincare I've done and done pretty consistently has paid off. I was 60 when I started filming and I'm 69 now. So I think that's pretty cool. I also noticed that with when I have the longer hair in 2022 and 2021, my hair was too long for my face, and this length, or I, even a little longer or, or shorter, is a better length for me. I, I figured that out. You know, I, you don't ever really stop and look at yourself. I don't anyway, and I notice that. My very favorite videos to film are when I talk about really good deals I get on things. I like to use what I like to use, but I don't wanna pay as much for it, and I don't have to. Speaking of good deals, there are gonna be good deals around Memorial Day. They'll have something on Father's Day. They'll have good, they'll have sales on 4th of July, just around any holiday. So those are the times that you need to be looking for great deals. I loved filming videos using Ulta reward points because I haven't got, since the pandemic, I have not gotten a 10 times points from Ulta, but that's how I could get some of my very best deals. I'm sure they're probably having problems, but I have gotten some for five times points. I also like to, to share with you just really random things that have made me happy, and I brought one in here to show you today. I use half and half, and this is a cart and a half and half. And for the last few years, when I open it, it's kind of hard to do. So I always just hold this back like this, and then I can open it. Well, lo and behold, there's somebody out there that realized that that can be a problem, and this is how they make it. This is a Bryn Dairy Half and Half 
But just look, they already have that taken down and all you have to do is reach it and go like that. So I saved these cartons so I could show you. But things like this really do make me happy. Today is my 665th video that I've uploaded on YouTube and there are 663 still up. I've only removed two videos, even though I would love to remove a bunch of them. I just thought that's who I was, that's what I thought at the time, and, and I'm not gonna take them away. Uh, it was when, in the beginning, before I started using Retin-A and the skincare that I use now, I used Philosophy, and the two videos were about morning and evening skincare. And I was getting questions on them and I thought, well, I don't do any of that anymore, so I'm gonna remove that. So I'm kind of proud of myself that I haven't deleted more because believe me, I'd like to. Now I'm gonna talk about some of the skincare items. Never in my wildest dreams did I ever think I would pay for water for my skin. Well, what I love is discontinued and I still have a bottle Oh, with about that much left in it. I mean, it's almost full. I have a few of the smaller bottles, but I was wanting to find something that was very similar to this because I'm afraid that even if IT Cosmetics comes out with a reformulated Miracle Water, it may not be the same. And this is called a three-in-one tonic. Well, I have four items I purchased trying to find something similar to this. The first thing I ordered was from Refer, R-E-P-H-R. They're known for their brushes. I had never tried anything from that company and they had some skincare and this is called a rebalancing essence. And I'm not gonna go into what's in these products and when, what isn't, but what I will say is this did not take the place. This is kind of a creamy formula. It feels wonderful but it is something that I don't want to put on my face in the morning. And I will use it up. I mean, I've put it on sometimes in the afternoon after I've done my uh, red light therapy and it just, it feels really good. But, so, but this is a not in the running, the rebalancing essence, but it was good. It, and it also was the same cost. The IT was $38, this is $38, and they both have the same amount of ounces. The IT Miracle Water is $4.47 an ounce. The retail was $38 when it was for sale, and that's the same here. I bought this for half price, but I'm not gonna go into, you know, that part. I'm just gonna talk about the retail price. This one I heard about from so many people, and I've heard about it for years. It's the Bioderma, the Sensitive, which is a pink cap. It's a micellar water, and I liked it. And what I, what I would do is I would put the IT Miracle Water on one half of my face, and I would try these for several days, at, you know, do it day by day by day, and just see how it made my skin feel and how it made my skin look. This is a very reasonable price. I think you can get it for about $13 for the eight plus ounces, which makes it a dollar some per ounce, which makes this the least expensive. I liked it, but it did not make my skin feel as good as I wanted it to. The next one, I know who I heard about this from, and this is from Laura Ray Beauty, is when I heard mention this. What it says on the bottle is Time Revolution, the first treatment essence and I really liked it. It came as close as anything. I've got one more item I to talk about. The Time Revolution is $27 and it has like 5.07 ounces in it. So that brings it, I think, to about $5.32. If that's not right, I'll write the correction in here. So this is the most expensive, but it's good. And I heard about this from Penn Smith. It is a skin conditioner made in Japan. It's a urea moisturizing serum. And I haven't used this as much, but I really like it. I think I've used it probably for a week at a time. I used it on one half and it, I used it on this half for one week. And I think this is the one I'm gonna go with. I'm not positive, but all of them are good. And what made me happy, I spent $20 for this. They're six and three quarter ounces and that made it less than $3 an ounce. I'm really pleased with that. I'm not gonna have any trouble when I'm done with this. I, I'm gonna go ahead and rotate these, 
but I can tell you that the Time Revolution and the Urea Moisturizing Lotion are, are my favorites. Okay, leave it to IT Cosmetics to change something else. I, for years, I used the IT Secret Sauce, and I loved it. It just, whenever I needed a moisturizer, it was perfect for me. I believe the retail price used to be $64, and of course, I always caught it on sale. They have reformulated it, and now it's $84 or $82, and I'm not really interested in trying, trying the reformulated version. I don't really have much luck with it, so I'm, I'm and I'm not willing to pay that much if I can find some things that I like that are less expensive. So the first thing I bought, and I bought this, oh, last fall, or, or longer, the Dermatology Peptide Night Cream. No scent whatsoever. When I need a moisturizer, I will use this at night, and I really have enjoyed it. I think this is $46 for two ounces, which is the same size as the IT. I always have a 20% off coupon code, and I can get it for less than $37. And sometimes when I say watch for sales, sometimes they'll be having larger sales. I'll sometimes see 25% or 30%. So, but I know I can always get it for 20% off. Well, Skin Diva came out with a moisturizing cream, and this is called the Hydrating Diva Moisturizer. No scent. I don't know. I've used this probably for a couple of months, and I don't use moisturizer every night, but when, but when I use moisturizers, I've used half and half and to see which one I like. This one, I believe, is my favorite. I think it's around $25. I can always get 20% off, so that makes it $20 for two ounces. I will use both of these, but well, I'm not going to spend 80 some dollars, even if I can get it half price, it's more expensive than these products, and I really do like them. This past winter, I really did anticipate that my skin would start getting drier, that I'd have dry patches. When I ordered the previous skincare item from Refer, I saw this tube of Intense Hydrating Cream 1.0 has a little key on the end of it. I really liked it. It very, very emollient. But I won't repurchase this because if I get dry spots, I like to use the Aquaphor Advanced Therapy Healing Ointment. Uh, it does better. Some people can use just plain old Vaseline. It tends to clog my pores. I can just use a very small amount of this or I always keep some timeless squalane oil, pure squalane oil. It's derived from olives. Those, if I have a little dry area somewhere, I can use those. So I'll use this, but I won't repurchase. Now I want to announce the winners of my last giveaway. And I have three winners. I went through random comment picker. I can't pick a word anymore. It won't, unless I pay for it. So what I do is I just load the, the names in random comment picker and then I hit select. And then I'll look and see the word was happy that was supposed to be in the comment that, that was left. So I'll kind of just have to change my qualifications, what I need for you to do later. And I'll be talking about that in just a few minutes. The very first name that popped up was Peggy S. Congratulations, Peggy. The next name was Cindy Forrester. Congratulations, Cindy. And the last winner is Shannon Flannery. Congratulations, Shannon. Make sure you all leave a comment below and I'll let you know how to get in touch with me. And those prizes were are being sent to you from Skin Diva and from Dermatology. So you'll get two separate boxes. So I'm excited for you. But I'm more excited right now about my giveaway for today because I think this is the biggest giveaway that I have done. Pretty sure it is. I always put back a certain percent of money that I have made from YouTube so I can do giveaways because if you didn't buy things from my links or you didn't watch my videos, I wouldn't make a cent. So I, I do love having giveaways and I think you know it. Well, I wish I could give away $900, but I can't. But I can get, I'm going to give away $500. I'm going to have five winners, 
and you're going to be able to get a hundred dollar e-gift card to wherever I can buy them. Wherever, if you want it and I can buy it, you can get it from there, or I can de deposit $100 in your PayPal account. Since this is a giveaway, I can't reply to comments here on this video, but you can go to absolutely any video, and you all have been doing that, and we've been having some good conversations. Um, and, and you can leave a question or a comment there, and I can easily get back to you, no matter how old the video is. I get notifications of comments on any video. And all you have to do to enter my giveaway is you have to be over 18 years old. I think we are pretty safe. And what I want you to do in the comment section, and this will not have any bearing on who wins or not, I'm just kind of interested in how long you've been watching me. If you know how you found me, that would be nice. Because there are people that I remember how I found them. I remember who mentioned them or what I was looking for. So if, if you happen to remember that, fine. If this is your very first video, just say this is the first time I've watched you. It is hard to believe I've been here nine years. Everything I learned, I learned from YouTube. I had, well, I won't go into that, but I mean, everything I learned about doing a video, I learned from YouTube. I, how do you do this? How do you do that? It, anyway, I just so thankful so many of you have chosen to watch me. And you know what? It is all good. As long as I have God in my life, it is all good. And it's been such a pleasure getting to know so many of you. I appreciate you. I thank you. And I'll see you in my next video. Take care. To uh, super. And what else do I want to do? And throughout this film, and there's always, you know, after, from 20, but I have a few of the white with, ooh, you take care. And, uh,